Hey, what's up everybody? My name's Ben and I'm one of the instructors here at Elite Welding Academy and today we're going to go over how to sharpen tungsten. All right, so what's up everybody and welcome to the Elite Welding Academy YouTube page. Again, today we're gonna to be going over how to sharpen tungsten. So you're gonna need a few PPE items before we get started. Obviously, you're gonna want a pair of gloves, safety glasses, and a face shield. You don't need to use a drill, but today I'm gonna to be using it because again, it just gets your hands away from the grinder and I feel it's a little bit safer. So I have two options that I'm gonna show you today. The first one is with a bench grinder and the second one is with an angle grinder. So let's get started. All right, so for this demonstration, we're gonna be using the red tip 2% Thor rated tungsten. It's eighth inch in diameter and we have a brand new piece, so both ends need to be sharpened. We're gonna sharpen one end with the bench grinder and we're gonna sharpen the other end with the angle grinder. But first thing, we gotta get it in the drill. So we're just gonna slide it in the drill. I like to use the trigger to tighten it up. Get it good and snug, make sure it's nice and tight. Give it a good tug, make sure it's not gonna fly out when you actually start applying pressure. And if we're all good, Let's get sharpening. So as you can see here, I'm lightly guiding the tungsten across the face of the disc, obviously just to wear it out evenly. Also notice that I'm spinning the drill at a relatively low RPM. This is so we don't actually overheat the tungsten. The one thing you don't want to do is get the tungsten so hot that it starts to glow during the sharpening process. Okay, so right here I just wanted to pause for a second and just evaluate the tungsten after we got done sharpening. Obviously you can see we got it to a very, very sharp tip. I kind of have a rule of thumb here. The idea is you want it to be almost needle sharp. If it will draw blood, it's probably sharp enough. If it won't, it probably needs to be resharpened. But the one important thing I really want to point out here is the degree of angle that the tungsten sharpened at. Notice that the angle of the tip of the tungsten is very similar to a pencil coming straight out of a pencil sharpener. That angle can dramatically affect the shape and the size of your arc. All right, so now that we have one end sharpened, we're gonna demonstrate how to sharpen the other end with an angle grinder. In order to do that, just pull the tungsten out, flip it around, back into the drill, tighten it up. Again, make sure it's snug. We're ready to sharpen the other end. Okay, so hand placement is very, very important when using an angle grinder to sharpen tungsten. As you can see here, I have my left hand on the trigger operating the grinder, and I'm guiding that tungsten with that finger again, keeping the RPMs of the drill relatively low. Using this process, you have to be a little bit more aware of your hand placement and be very, very careful during the sharpening process. All right, so as you can see, we got this other end sharpened. Took a little bit longer with an angle grinder. Bench grinders are a little bit more efficient. We obviously recommend a bench grinder. It's a little safer, it's a little bit faster, but typically out in the field, this is how you'll be sharpening your tungsten. Okay, so that pretty much wraps up the video. If you guys have any questions, comments, or anything like that, I want you to leave them in the comments down below. One last little tip I'm gonna give you, actually by cutting your tungsten in half, you can take one piece of tungsten and get four sharp ends out of it. Great for field welds, so remember that one. We'd like to thank you guys for checking out the video. If you did like the video, give it a like. Please hit that subscribe button. Please definitely check out all the links below and follow us on Instagram and TikTok and all the social media platforms. But that's all we got for today, guys. So have a good one. We'll see you later.